I'm Jane Bain and I'm a still life painter. The themes I follow are the themes that are interesting to me. The, the pears and the lemons, the, the nature of things, trying to take something that's small and outgrow it, make it larger, um, just to give it that different look, that different dimension. I treat my pears and lemons as portraits. I don't treat them as still lives. I would almost relate the pear in particular to the female form, that it's a very natural shape it's like doing a life drawing for me. It's, it's, it's positioning, it's everything. I'm mainly self-taught, but I um, did study graphic design at um, the London College of Printing. And as you can see by many of my paintings, I was fairly influenced by that through the graphic forms that um, I saw and I see in pictures. I started painting on cardboard in Singapore my, my shopping was delivered in cardboard boxes that had these amazing different graphics on that I couldn't throw away. And it developed when I first painted a pear on one of them and I cut it up and it looked fascinating, to me anyway. And I just liked the idea that the pear might have left the orchard in a box marked pears. But by the time it got to me, it wasn't in a box marked pears. It was in a box mart noodle chicken. Um, and they had all these amazing Chinese calligraphy over them, different colors, just things that are unusual for me. Um, and I liked the way my pair sat with them. My bird paintings were developed from when I did a lot of work um, at home. There, there was birds in my garden and it started off with this um, olive backed um, sunbird that came to visit me every day and sing on my balcony and it was fascinating. That carried on in the UK, house sparrows. They, they are so sweet and cheeky but I don't draw them small, I draw them larger than life, sitting on a fence, poking their head over, just hoping for a little tidbit. Similarly with my um, lemon pictures, I was in Andalusia and we was sitting underneath a lemon tree, sunbathing, and I looked up and like, wow, there were all these lemons hidden amongst the leaves in the tree and that became a great inspiration to me, that became my next series of paintings. And I just was trying to create that intensity that you, you get when you look up into a tree and you see those hidden gems, you see those lemons. Limes don't do it for me, lemons do.